Hey, what's going on guys? Moby Chin, welcome back to another episode of Mob Survival World. This is episode 13. And today, we are starting off with no armor on. We're completely naked right now, what the heck? I decided I'm done with iron. We're done. Not having it anymore. And in between episodes, I have been grinding a lot of XP. I did a lot of off-camera enchanting. Just a moment, actually. Let me go sleep really quick. I decided, you know, let's just get this done. Let's get it out of the way. Uh, as I, I'm pretty sure I previously mentioned it, I went on a pretty good um, mining run. Got like a couple stacks of diamonds and everything, so we're pretty stacked as it is now. And I decided, you know, we have the XP form like I wanted. Uh, we've got a level 30 enchanting table. Let's get it. So I went ahead. I'm, r I'm just running over to the valuables room really quick so we can take a look. I don't think I came over here. Yeah, we got uh, three stacks and nine. Plus we have some still left over back up at the um, enchanting area. So... We've got a pretty nice helmet with Aqua Affinity, Protection 3, a Breaking 3, Respiration 3, a Projectile Protection 4, and a Breaking 3 on the chest plate. We've got Blast Protection 4, and a Breaking 3 on the Diamond Leggings, a Breaking 3, Fire Protection 3, Death Strider 3, Feather Falling 3 on the boots, a Sharpness 4, Sweeping Edge 3 sword, and then just a random old pick. And now I do have another Diamond Sword on me because the current level 30 enchant in the enchanting area is looting 3, and I need that, I need that, I need that. So I'm going to be, uh, definitely next time I go to grind out some levels in this guy, hitting level 30 and getting that level 30 in chain off. However, that's not what we're going to be doing in today's video. In today's video, oh yeah, that looks so nice. Man, it's been so long since I've worn full diamond armor. Probably, uh, last time I did was when I was playing on Chaotic. Looks nice. It looks nice. Yeah, so... In this video, we are going to be doing just a little bit of work around the base area. There are a couple things that I wanted to get done, some things that I thought about in, between, in the meantime. Um, let's go ahead and we'll dip down into our farming area real quick so you guys can see our weed is fully grown and I made two more levels. This is carrots right here and down another, this will be potatoes. Let's sip real quick. Mm. Throat was starting to hurt. Mm. Oh, goodness. Um, yeah, so... What, what am I... What am I looking for here? Oh, right. So, in this episode, I just wanted to do a little bit of cleanup in this area. You know, completely take down all the random blocks in the walls and throw up stone. I don't have any fantastic ideas for wall design right now uh, that I can think of. So, I was just going to completely replace it inside and out with stone. And then, I want to do a couple of things. Let's bounce up to the top here. I love this thing so much. I want to build a couple more. So, I was thinking for easier access to our village area, and I'm gonna, and I also want to build a, uh, wood farm over here, a tree farm, <laughs> in the near future, maybe even in this episode, maybe in this episode I just get a bunch of things done, and then in the next episode we do some exploring, or maybe in the next episode we get the tree farm, I don't know, we'll see how long it, everything else takes me. So I would like to get a tree farm over here, and obviously we have the villager breeder way out there, so I'd like a little hole out the side of the hill here uh, with a bridge leading down over there, coming inside here and having uh, two little areas, one to shoot me right the way up to here so I can get into this base easily, and one to drop me down into here so I can get into here easily without having to run all the way over to this side, fall down and zoom right back up or whatever. So yeah, I think that is what we are going to do. So I'm gonna just, you know, give you guys some updates as we go along. I did smelt a ton, a ton, a ton of cobblestone. In between episodes, I smelt like ha a single chest 
worth? Yeah, just over a single chest's worth. Um, just because of how much cobble or how much stone brick it took to build the uh, XP grinder, I did want to add a couple more levels to it and do some redesigns. That's in a future episode, though. Uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started on this project. And I don't have a shovel. Didn't even think about that. Zip right up here. We need to get our other tools enchanted with unbreaking and efficiency. Boom, and we really need to get that potato farm section going. That's why I really need the tree farm, as I keep running out of acacia wood. Uh, I haven't run out in a while because of just how much I got last time and how little I've used it. But I am indeed out now just from the farm area doing those staircases going up and down it since I'm doing both sides in the same direction it's uh, rather expensive so let's go ahead and get on with this and we'll see where we're at after this alrighty guys so we got all of that done but I decided really quick that I'd like to oh you gotta be joking I thought I'd solved the issue of having dirt blocks here in the corner. And I just replaced them with oak fences. But that's right, you can only place them on top of oak fences, not on the sides. So rip. Dang it. I just made all these oak fences for nothing then. Oof. Alright, well, that's alright. We can throw them back in the chest. I don't know why I keep running past the wood chest. That's right there. I'll keep that on me, I guess. Let's go dump this stuff off, and then we will start work on the next project. Get out. That's right, now you guys don't stand a chance now that I got my diamonds out. Um, over this way. Let's see here. What do I have on me? I've got some cobblestone. These guys, some of this, some of that, a couple of those, and that'll do it. So we'll just throw these other random items in there for now. So now what we need to get to work on is, let's see, I think I also want an elevator over here somewhere in this area to get us up and down it's just because oh the travel from going to this base all the way over to the XP grinder is certainly no fun hmm what could I do? How could I link the XP grinder to the rest of the base? I'll think about that one. I'll think about that one. We'll take a minute. We'll think about that. For now, we can go ahead and get to work on this other side, though. Let me just move everything around. Let me grab that diamond axe. Before I forget. There we go. All right, let's take a peek. I definitely know I want something over here. Where is the question? Maybe I don't make it too deep in. Oh, excuse me. Hmm. I did have to knock open. Oh, wait a minute. This could be perfect. This could be perfect right here. Little bridge going down over to there from this. And this takes us inside into uh, the. Let's see. How would I want to do this? What would I link it up to in this space? Because I do. I don't have a lot of space on that side. But I have. 
have space on this side, but I did want to make a sugarcane cactus farm area. Maybe I, because this is right over my sheeps, isn't it? Yes. Maybe I shoot it backwards this way and hook it to the left like this. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Where is it at? The hole is right here-ish. If I go backwards like this, and go this way. Ah, it's too sharp of an angle. I'd like it to be right here, and to go right like this, and then like this. And then like this, and then like this, and into there. That'd be nice. And then maybe we do have an entrance into the sugarcane area. I don't know why we'd need that for paper, maybe? For trading with the villagers? Hmm. Alright, well, actually, you know what? We'll get started on this. I'll try to figure out some kind of layout, and then I will let you guys know where I'm at. Alrighty guys, so found something. Ah, oh, hey. Hey, not cool, not cool. Come here. You still exploded, you little, d oh, what the frick. Oh, come on. One of the one areas I didn't want to ever have to rebuild. Shoot. Little turd man, that's ridiculous. Exploded so fast, I didn't even have a chance. sealed back up at least I can fix fix a hole from the inside shoot man um okay well I did not realize that I would run into this cave not sure there's much I could do with it at this point um hmm yeah I ought to just go ahead and light the whole thing up do with this. I'm gonna expose a whole lot more of it here in a second. How much do I have left on this side? Two blocks? Oof. Might have mined a little bit too far forward then over there. Let's see here. Definitely need to get some torches on this side of the room. Oh no, I got it right. Nice. Okay, yes, yeah, so this is just a basic layout for the sugarcane farm. That's what I was trying to do here, and then I can just do it right like that. And that seals up that. And that will make that. And that finishes off torches in this room. I'll do something right like that in the center and light it all up. Cool. Um, okay, so now that we've got this, we can make our entrance into this area. Let's go see what Y level we're working with over here. Where is it? Where are you at? Down one? 
Okay, okay. All right, if we leave the floor right there. This could be perfect. Let me drill out something right like this. Obviously, we'll raise this roof. Right through there by one. Boom, this will be perfectly aligned with that sugarcane farm. So let's drill out from the corner of the sugarcane farm. Let's see how far we have to get. Oof. The sugarcane farm should be pretty big, so its corner should be like over there-ish already, I think. Let's turn off coordinates. And down we go. All right. So if I drill from this right here, I can always patch it up later. Let's just see where we get. Give it to me. Come on. Come on. There it is. Perfection. Nice. Nice. So that wall is perfect. I just need to knock this one back a little bit more. We'll definitely try to make this one more cave-like than some of the other ones have been so far. So we can make it a bit more windy, I guess. Um, yeah, so we'll go ahead and get a basic layout, and then we'll let you guys know where we're at. Alrighty, guys. So, here we have it done. It's looking nice. And there we go. Me... Yeah, something right like that ought to do. That's a little bit better. So I'll have to bump up right here. Nice. Right on in. Okay, cool. Yeah, so this is what... Oh, shoot. We are looking like here for our little entrance into the area. S pretty, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. So, why, why do I keep unloading those chunks back there? Ugh. Whatever. Now I just need a tunnel upwards to get up on out of here and up to there relatively quickly we can do that right about this is a good amount of wall just need a four block area set it up similar to how we did the other one it's three back four back will be right here that cool and we'll drill this out take it all backwards oops So let me go grab some more water. Water buckets, water buckets, water, 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 boom. Sweet. 
something right like that. We can place one of those guys on either side there. And yeah, we can do it right like that. That'll light it up pretty well. I'll yeah, we'll need to figure out a little bit better lighter lighting system. Maybe I'll have to go and get some more glowstone. What a pain that would be though. Okay, it looks like it's pretty good going all the way up. Oh my. Got some pretty thick dirt areas right here. Nice. Okay, cool. So there's that. Let's get this guy out of our way. Oh yeah, you're in the sun now. You're gone. Okay. Let's jump ourselves down here. Grab some kelp. And I keep the kelp. Not much kelp. We should be good with not a lot. Boom. Grab my beans. Oh shoot. Meant to grab this guy. Nether items. Where you at? One soul sand. <laughs> okay. Probably should have gone up and oh yeah, I should start from the top down. That way it'll be easier. Cool. Alright, this is coming together quite well. This is coming together quite well. I did the uh oof oof gang, okay. Uh Shoot. Shoot. I need to drop. Let's test this respiration and aqua affinity. Alright, we're going pretty good here. And Respiration 3, shoot, it holds up for quite a while. I did not realize that. Um. I have no signs on me. I have no space either. Oops. Oops. Just realized I didn't have glass. The top I didn't have signs. We'll do slabs for now. And then we'll. Oh shoot! No, I need signs. I definitely need signs. No doubt about it. All right, now you guys can sit here for a second. Except for that mini should be fine for whatever I come across. Will three be enough? No. Certainly not. Boom. We'll just go ahead and do all six. Make life easy. There we go. That's done. Nice. Um, let me put that right there. I just realized, yeah, I won't be able to put one in that corner. Which is fine, I guess. So now we just gotta go right up like this. And we'll... Make another pair of shears real quick. Nice. Oh, yeah. What a jet. Boom. Nice. So two in this direction. Get down right here. Should drop us right on top. Perfect. Perfect. Let's make a little landing pad all the way up here. Um we'll extend out this dirt, I guess.
Alright, that ought to look decent. <laughs> that ought to look decent when it fully fills in and everything, but that's alright. That's good right there. We'll have to go ahead and you can break this one too. Screw it. Just set it. Looks a little bit more realistic. Yeah, something right like that. That ought to do. That ought to do. So nice. Um, sweet. Easy instant access. Fall in here. Go straight across. We go up. Boom. We're at our base. Oh, that's beautiful. That is fantastic. Alright, and I'm just one more of those to plan out. Maybe I just do an up and down over here and not connect it to the rest of the base. Where would I even put it? Uh, I think I'm going to have to think about this one a little bit more. Maybe I just drill into the wall over here a good ways. And you know, what I could do is I could do it right in through there at a diagonal. All right, yeah, I'm feeling this. Right in through here like this. Let's see. So how far do I need to come down to make ground level? Let's fill this in. I need a bucket of water real quick. I can do this one pretty fast. No need for cut. This will probably be. Yeah, actually, we'll go ahead and we'll finish this one up, and then that'll wrap up this video because we've been going on for quite a while here. And I think this will be a nice, decent stopping point. Okay. Right about there ought to be good. Um, oh yeah, F3, we need to go all the way down to looking at 73. Alright. Let's get up here somehow. Hopefully this will be the last time that I have to climb up like this. Um, a decent chunk of area straight in from the corner here. We can do it right here. Good. Put this back some more. Give us a little bit more space to work with. Something right like that. That ought to be fine. So we can do. Uh, we'll do one across from each other. Oopsies. We can do one like. Where's that tree? So we can do our down right here. And are up. Do the down here. And that's four blocks like that's four blocks like this. So maybe the down there. It's four blocks like that. And then do the up right there. No. Okay, we can do the down there. Fine, so let's go down to 73, 80, okay, we got, ooh, this will be a bit of a further one, nice, so then we can just kind of drill a little hole out here, something cave looking, just let me see the dumb other end, really, 
Goodness. Right, it's a little bit further back than I thought it would be. That's alright. Carve it right out like this. Decent. Let's curve this guy backwards. Right there. Open up into a nice whitish room. I don't need this anymore. Looking good. go sweet okay let's uh, light this place up real quick probably should have redone the floor before I did that but that's all right Let me go ahead and take care of that right now oopsies Yeah, that's fine. Alright. Got a lot of progress done in this video here for getting mobility around the base. It's just becoming so annoying climbing up and down this hill. I can't take it anymore. solution in than these two caves we just made uh, maybe in between videos or in the next video or something I don't know because torches on the ground does not look amazing but it'll have to do for now boom right like that yeah this will be nice so we can um yeah screw it I'm not going back up oops Let's do the walls too. All right, and this one can go out right like that. And this can go back. This can go up. Good amount. Alright, there we go, that's not too bad. Nice, this is in the way a little bit. I feel like, okay, cool. Yeah, this'll work. Something right like this. Um, let me throw down my crafting bench. Uh, we'll make one more because we do need a good amount of signs. There we go. Oops, actually, shoot. We need the wall to come out one more. Right there. Let's see, I'm gonna throw myself up real quick so I can get rid of this. Am I really out of stone? Shoot. That's alright. Um. I'll run back into the base really quick, grab a few items that I need. Oh dear god. Oh my lord. Panic attack of a lifetime, but that's blast protection for you. Goodness. Didn't even freaking hear the dumb thing. Holy cow. Oh my god. 
god. They gave me a heart attack. Oh my lord. Goodness. Oh. Ah, oh, man. Let's use this other one really quick. Just because we have it. Nope, not that guy. This guy. Boom. Ridiculous, ridiculous, ridiculous. Oh my lord. God bless, that scared me. Oh man. Creepers. What can you do? Another items. We need a piece of soul sand, and we can go ahead. Let's throw these in there. And I don't need anything else, do I? I need stone. I need a piece of stone. Stone. We'll just grab a whole stack because we might have to fix where that creeper just exploded. We'll need a little bit more dirt to throw some in there. I did. Nice. All right. Zooming. Man, I love having these things all around the base. And maybe we'll go ahead and take out that glass too. Need to figure out some kind of nice little landing pad. Maybe I just redecorate it all into. Um, goodness, man, he did a good amount of. Time. Okay, that's fine, I guess. We'll just yeah, knock this out. He did a good amount of damage. Oh shoot! Where's my hole? Really creeper. You gonna do man's like this? Should be diagonal, so right here ish, I think. Frick. I think so. We'll just place that there, we'll drop down like this. So we need to get this side done too. There we are. a lot of fall damage. Let's get out the shears. All went right the way up. That right there like that. And we're zooming. Nice. Let's grab another water source from right over here. Ouch. We can throw it Boom, perfect. Easy. And now we have quick access to this side of the area. Awesome. Sweet. Alright, that worked out well. Nice. Everything is all nice and done. We can easily get from our XP grinder to our enchanting area, base, house, dealy. Uh, and then from there to the villager area and the breeder and where we're going to make the tree farm and all that kinds of cool stuff. This was a good episode. This was a good episode. Awesome. Well, we got a lot done in this one. A lot of moving around and all that kind of stuff it makes it easier to get around the base. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Like to me if you do enjoy it. I want to see some more from the survival series. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Until then, see you guys later. Peace.